Hi everybody, so today I'm going to do an unboxing and initial impressions video of a brand new Bible that just came out. It's called the He Reads Truth Bible. This one is in the CSB and it looks like the postal people probably were carrying it from these sections because it's almost torn through. But luckily it's still intact so hopefully everything is good on the inside. So this is going to be a Bible by Holman. All right, so I'm gonna drop this camera down just a little bit. Okay, so we've got the He Reads Truth Bible. So this one is going to be in the brown genuine leather. It's also thumb indexed. Comes in a two-piece box. There's some information about it there. Some of the features here. And some information about the He Reads Truth. And then also their website there, the hereadstruth.com. Here's the ISBN number. Does retail for $159.99. And you can definitely find it for less online. And I will put a link in the description box. All right, so we've got a brown genuine leather. Looks like just a few little scuffs across there. Don't know if you can quite see that on there, but it's probably going to get a few scuffs anyway. Then we've got on the spine, He Reads Truth Bible, Christian Standard Bible, and the Holman logo. So that is a nice looking leather. We do have the thumb indexing. And this one looks like it is all in gold, so that's kind of neat. Our gilding looks nice. We've got two ribbons. Book block is kind of curved, so that is nice. So let's look on the inside of this one. They also have the She Reads Truth, if you're familiar with that one. And I'll link that one in the description box as well. So we're going to have a vinyl paste down liner. Got a presentation page. And this is, you usually will always have these little pieces of paper from where the thumb indexing was. There are different cover options. So there's the different ISBN numbers. So I like that, men in the word of God every day. And that's, for being brand new right out of the box, that's laying totally flat, and we're not even into the Bible section yet, so that's pretty impressive. So we've got a how to read the Bible. And I'll show more of this in the full review. But I like the color with the green. So we're going we're gonna to have all of the key features, like a genre indicator, key verses, book introductions, and their maps in these are really unique. There's going to be different uh, reading plans and outlines. So this, these are the pages with all of the features. So you can see that there's a lot of information on those pages. So lots of features. Then we've got our genre guide that's got all the different colors for the different books. So one thing that I can tell right away is that it's a little bit different than the women's version because the women's has that color on each page of that book as far as the beginning of the pages. But they probably didn't do this one quite as colorful because it is geared towards men. Then we've got the languages of the Bible. So we've got Hebrew, Aramaic, and Greek. And it gives you the charts. So that's kind of cool. Because we've got the Hebrew and the blue, Aramaic, and an orange color and Greek in the green. So I'll just give you a quick look at that. It tells you each book. And then how much of it was in the Hebrew, how much was in the Aramaic. So that's pretty neat. 
I'm not sure that I've seen that before. Introduction to the CSB, and then we get into the Old Testament. So they're going to have the key verses like what they do in the females version of it. And then it looks like we've got a book introduction with the timeline, a little background, message and purpose. Give thanks for this book. It's got a reading plan in the front of it, the outline. And it's going to be a single column paragraph format with the wide margins. So one thing you can kind of see right off the bat is there is going to be some ghosting in this. It looks like the camera is picking it up a little bit worse than what I'm seeing it just looking at it. I'm not sure what size the font is because I couldn't find anything that said that. So I'm not sure if it's in eight or not. But I'll just kind of flip through this just a little bit, give you a quick look at it. So these are what I think is really neat in these Bibles is their maps because they're super unique. I mean, that's just something that you're not going to see unless you've got one of the She Reads Truth. And I do really like the way they did the thumb indexing on this one. Nice margins in here. We've got two ribbons. So we've got a white one there. Let's see what our other one is. Looks like it's a red. If I can get a hold of it. Yeah, so they're both double satin. One white, one red. So that looks nice. But the binding on this feels really good. I really do like these key verses that they've got in here. I think those are really neat. That's actually less ghosting than what I was anticipating. Because there's not, it's not too bad there. But as soon as I pull that page away from the other one, and hardly see any. And it is line match, so that is going to help. I don't know if the paper in this one is any different than the paper in the other editions or not. But you're going to have where you have these verses and stuff on the back pages. Of course, you're going to have some ghosting from that. I believe it is just a black letter. Sorry for my voice keeps cutting out. I think I've got a cold or something coming on. That's kind of neat, the key people in Matthew. So it's got all the different people. That's pretty neat. I want to see what we've got at the end here. I don't think there's much towards the end of this. So it looks like we've got the end of Revelation and then it looks like key verses. One year reading plan. And then we just get to the end of the Bible. We do have the table of weights and measures. But we're not going to have any maps or anything like that other than just the in-text maps. Yeah, so this page here, you can see a lot of the stuff on the back side of the page from these. But in just the text portion, it's not as bad. The poetry sections are always going to be worse, of course. But that's a nice looking Bible lays really really flat so watch for a full review of this one coming up there again is the ISBN number it is the he reads truth and then there's also the women's version of the she reads truth this is the thumb indexed version so just a little bit more color in here and some different devotions for women
Yeah, so that's a nice Bible. So I will be reviewing that one here coming up in the next few weeks. All right. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.